Yo, 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 I'm back. And uh, today I got some things to talk about. This is CSGI Joe coming at you with another one. Now, this is my fresh new video. Uh, I wasn't able to blog anything because I had to go to the dentist and one of my chops are gone, but I still can talk, you know. So that's why I didn't make no new videos lately. But, but, uh, I looked at some of the comments and y'all yeah, been talking to me. And I appreciate that. And as I showed off the army bill, one person said, I don't see no crimson guards. But check this out. I don't like the order, for real. Things get messed up. You got a bunch of porch pirates these days. So some things come to me, when they come to me, I snatch out, I snatch out heavy, you know. So, I was at my local Walmart, I wanted to really put this on, but, you know, they had the music going, I didn't want my little new channel to get flagged or anything, so I really couldn't uh, film that for y'all. So I decided to come home and do a, a little film. Somebody was really telling me, like, what's up, you know, you don't see no Crimson Guards, you know what I'm saying? Well, as you see, you know, as all of these Crimson Twins, then I seen them in the stores, which was cool. So I grabbed another pair of them. So I got two pair of Crimson Twins. Shouldn't even have to prove that. Y'all should just believe me. Believe me when I tell you, I do. But uh, I was able to snatch out on some nice things today at Walmart, my local Walmart, yeah. I was able to snatch out on these two right here. Oh yeah, the Crimson Bats. And before you know it, I was taking them all out the box and things, you know. And those who follow me on my uh, Instagram, y'all know what it is, you know. So they say, I'm not an army builder. Well, I just snatched up these two boys. Oh yeah. Real nice. Got two in my collection. You know, got two of them. You know, make sure this guy stands up because I hate them when they fall. Bam, there you go. You should stand up. Wow, yeah. Then, came across this guy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. And before you know it, I unboxed those two and I got to him and I said, hold up. Somebody did question me about where those Crimson Guards at, huh? Well, here's one of them, you know. And like I said, if you've been following me on Instagram, you know what it is, what I've been doing with these boys. Take them to a whole nother level, a whole nother level. You know, whole nother level of the game. Make them stand up good. There you go. That should do it. That should do it. Uh oh. There you go. You know. And then came across this guy. Yeah. Uh-huh. Came across this guy, yeah, uh-huh. Came across this guy, yeah, uh-huh. And then I just stopped. I said, you know what? I'm not gonna keep going because I could go ahead and get the whole roster, but I left some because I noticed that there are other collectors out there. See, a lot of people probably say, man, you greedy, you greedy. No, I'm not greedy. I just know that there are others that think like me. And I want them to get in on some of this G.I. Joe experience. So, I left a few bats there. Now, if they're not there by Tuesday, I may go and snatch them all up. But for now, I'm just gonna chill. You know, I'm just gonna chill. You know? 
But uh, that's just to whoever said where them Crimson Guards at. Watch the video and I just showed you where them Crimson Guards at. I got a whole of them. I got a whole of them. A whole lot of them. And I will be having them. But enough said, you know, let's get back on to Hasbro. You know, yeah, let's talk to Hasbro. I think, and you guys could talk to me on this. I think that our next uh, HasLab project should be the Night Raven. Because that thing is so unique. And if they really wanted that thing to really sell, they could put some lights on it, you know. Make it, I mean, just make it so super superb for the six inch. It'd be pretty big, don't get me wrong. I know everybody gonna tell me, oh, that's gonna, that's gonna take up a lot of space. I know it's supposed to, it's the Night Raven. You heard what I just said, the Night Raven. And yes, it should be a nice size, you know. I think that would be so super dope for the next thing that comes out on a HasLab. Even though we want something for G.I. Joe, I do. But they did do something for Cobra. I think the Night Raven would be so dope. And the way that the Night Raven can look, if you guys remember the uh, G.I. Joe movie, The uh, Rise to Cobra, that Night Raven. And the reason why I say that they should do a night raven because when I looked at the little poster which I'm gonna show you guys I'm gonna show you guys right now the little poster is so oh man the poster is like moving things back you guys can really see this poster man it's man this would be so so super cool let's move the camera back a little bit And let's boost this camera up a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Oh, don't want the camera to fall. Bam. But look at this poster. The Night Raven. Off the movie, G.I. Joe, The Rise. The Rise of Cobra, I'm sorry. Yeah. Wouldn't this be outstanding? The new Night Raven for the G.I. Joe Classified series. Man. Look at that. Just put this in your head, guys. I know it'll be big. It'll take up some space. With lights on it and everything. Man. This thing will be loved. But enough said, what do you guys think? What sh should the HasLab do for G.I. Joe? What should be the next project? Comment, sound off, you know what I'm saying? Hit the like button. Uh, comment, subscribe to me, you know what I'm saying? And uh, check me out. And once again, this is your boy CSGI Joe. And as you can see, I'm um, unboxing. Yeah, as we talk. So, uh. Get ready to see these boys in action. But once again, this your boy CSGI Joe, and I'm out of here. Peace.